For the second time, Suella Braverman has lost her job as Home Secretary. Nobody's, it is nobody's almost ever done that before. It is all, I think, <laughs> we think it is book. unprecedented. Now, tell us about this dramatic intervention from Suella Braverman tonight. We know that the Home Secretary is not happy that this pro-Palestinian march uh, is going ahead in London on Saturday because, of course, it is Armistice Day. Now, as you say, this intervention by Suella Braverman, front page of The Times, says Suella Braverman accuses Met Police of double standards over protests. She he says the Metropolitan Police is playing favourites. They're soft on certain protests. This is a hate march. She's criticising the police. But where is the Prime Minister in this? Do we believe the Prime Minister signed off that kind of inflammatory rhetoric? Well, Jane, I was just listening in to that uh, briefing for journalists from the Prime Minister's official spokesperson. He was absolutely clear that this article had not been cleared uh, by Number 10. Are you resigning, Home Secretary? You have to get sacked. Many other cabinet ministers have said uh, the words that she used are not words that I myself would have used. Uh, there were clashes and skirmishes between uh, what the police call counter-protesters and, and some of the officers here who have been stationed uh, at the Cenotaph. Protected today by tradition, a Home Secretary whose job is in the balance. Remembrance will soon give way to politics. When I'm here next week, will the Home Secretary still be Home Secretary? Well, look, as you know, and I know well, um, a week's a long time in politics. Not resigned, sacked. Suella Braverman was sacked by Rishi Sunak this morning. She actually got sacked by Liz Truss as well, just a few days before Liz Truss's own demise. So two stints as Home Secretary, sacked twice by two different Prime Ministers.